things you didn't know you needed off of Amazon. This is our cordless handheld vacuum that we use to vacuum out our cars. Not only is it super slim and easy to store away, it also comes with a USB charging cable, which is my favorite part because if I'm in an emergency, I can just plug it into my car real quick and I'll be good to go. Things you didn't know you needed off of Amazon. Guys, I found a foldable digital food scale and it has saved so much room in my cabinet. It measures in grams, fluid ounces, and milliliters. It has an auto power off feature, comes with your battery, and folds down into convenient storage size. Things you didn't know you needed off of Amazon. This is a Bluetooth car diagnostic scanner. Plug this device into your car and it connects to an app on your phone where you can literally find out what's wrong with your car within seconds. It will tell you why your check engine light came on, if the battery life on your car is in good shape, and basically everything in between. Things you didn't know you needed off of Amazon. If you live in a humid area, this is a must have. It's a mini dehumidifier that absorbs the moisture in the air. It's cordless, it can absorb up to six ounces of moisture, and when the beads in the middle turn green, just plug it into a wall outlet to dry out the beads, and then you're good to go for another use. Things you didn't know you needed off of Amazon. This is the pink stuff. It's a Miracle Paste all-purpose cleaner. I would love to list all the surfaces that this stuff can clean stains off of, but we would be here for way too long, and y'all would get bored of me. All you do is apply with a damp cloth or sponge, rub it in gently, and rinse off with clean water. Things you didn't know you needed off of Amazon. A cordless electric screwdriver. If you don't have a drill on hand, there is nothing worse than trying to unscrew or screw in those tiny screws in tight places. This comes with six bits and a switch that turns it into forward and backwards motion. Things you didn't know you needed off, off of Amazon. Amazon. This is a car air purifier. It releases 4.8 million negative ions that removes dust, pollen, smoke, and bad odors from your car. With this little gadget, you can have that brand new car smell forever. Things you didn't know you needed off of Amazon. This might look like a plastic jar, but it's actually a boiled egg peeler. And I know what you're thinking, Rachel, there is no way that that little jar can take away all my struggles when it comes to peeling boiled eggs. The final result will shock you. Just fill to the red line with water, place the egg inside, pop the lid back on, and shake back and forth until you see the shell start to loosen up. This has become my go-to when it comes to peeling hard-boiled eggs and saves me so much time in the kitchen. Things you didn't know you needed off of Amazon. How has no one ever shown me this before? This is our drill brush set, and it's basically a power scrubber that attaches to your pre-owned drill. We have the yellow set of brushes, which is the medium stiffness, and it's good for all your bathroom surfaces, like your shower, your tub, your sinks, and so forth. There is nothing worse than getting on your hands and knees and having to scrub the base of your shower or your bathtub, and this makes it so much easier. It cleans it so fast, and you can see the final result here. It's just incredible. I don't know how we lived without it. Things you didn't know you needed off of Amazon. This is our pour over coffee maker. Nicholas swears that pour over coffee is way better than drip coffee. I honestly can't tell the difference, but let us know your opinion in the comments. All you do is add your ground coffee in hot water and that's it. The dripper rests securely on a variety of different mug sizes, which we have so many different mugs, so I can attest to that. The auto drip tank precisely controls water flow over the coffee grounds and the lid holds in heat and doubles as a drip tray. Things you didn't know you needed off of Amazon. This is waterproof car window film. Traveling on a rainy day gives me so much anxiety, and as you see here, when water normally hits your window, it becomes very foggy and hard to see through. This film is anti-glare, anti-fog, and waterproof, so you'll never have trouble seeing out your rearview mirror again. The film comes in so many different sizes and comes with all the tools you need to apply it perfectly. It's the cheapest solution that I've found to see better when you're traveling through a storm. Amazon find number four, this watch is a game changer for those of you that suffer from motion sickness, seasickness. Um, I can't even go in the car with my husband driving without me getting sick, so I wear this watch. You put the gel on that they give you on the inside of your wrist, and then you have the sensor from the watch also on the inside of your wrist. Um, then you turn it on to activate it and you can adjust the different levels. You'll feel like a slight tingling sensation in the middle of your palm and you know it's working. Good luck.
Filling water tank empty. Please refill water. Hey guys, since my video about the Tenco i4 vacuum mop went viral and now it's sold out everywhere, I wanted to compare it to the newer version, which is the Tenco i4 III. So here's me showing you the original one, which I still absolutely love. It's such a time saver that it vacuum and mops at the same time. Now the Tenco i4 III just got delivered, so I wanna try it out for you guys for the very first time. My initial reaction is that I love the charging station, the digital display, and you can definitely tell it's a little bit more heavy duty. All right, and just like the original, I absolutely love it. They both would be getting a five-star rating from me. Look at all that stuff that it picks up. Absolutely disgusting. Okay, so now for the true test, that self-cleaning mode. So the original took about 45 seconds, and this is how it left the brush and the inside. As you can see, the brush is clean, but you still need a good wipe down. With the iFloor 3, the actual self-cleaning mode was a lot longer, and look at how clean it left that whole system and the brush. Which one would you guys choose? My four kids go back to school next week and I saw these dissolvable hand soaps that I thought would be perfect for their backpack rather than sending them with liquid hand sanitizer. I went onto Amazon and bought a four pack so each one could have their own pack. There's about a hundred little soap papers inside of there. So I went ahead and tried it out. I put one of the dissolvable papers on my hand and then washed my hand for a good 20 seconds. I was so surprised how soft my hands were. It smelled really good and there wasn't any sticky residue left behind. So I think it's perfect for the backpack. I was on fine 59. I've been spending so much money every month on Shakeology and I know it has great benefits, but I started doing some research to see what other shakes are comparable that are cheaper. I came across this ideal shake that was on Amazon. And let me just tell you, I like it so much better and it was like one third of the price. My favorite way to make it is the chocolate one. So I just take one big scoop and then a banana or half of a banana, a cup of ice and half a cup of water. And let me just tell you, it comes out so creamy and delicious. It's literally like drinking a chocolate milkshake. I look forward to drinking it every day. I do not get any credit for selling this to you, unlike Shakeology, but look at that. $37 for this compared to $129 for the same amount of servings. It's absolutely crazy. Not to mention it has a lower sugar count and calorie count. All right, so who likes cleaning out their hairbrush? Cause I know I definitely do not. So my daughter actually sent me this cause she knows how much I hate cleaning out my hairbrush. So I wanted to give it a try. So I brushed my hair and I always shed so much. So look at all the hair that was in the brush. So all you do is kind of just push the little things in the back and then it literally just pulls the bristles back, which allows you just to kind of wipe the hair off. It is a total game changer for brushing your hair. And I got it from Amazon under 20 bucks. So here is the actual screenshot. Amazon find number 57. So I have all these reusable straws in my house that just are a pain to clean. So the clear one, you can always see dirt. The metal one, you can never see if it's clean. So I got these reusable straws. First of all, I love the colors that they come in. They're so bendable, but the coolest part is, is they literally just open right up. So they're so easy to clean. You can definitely tell whether you're cleaning it or not. And then you could just put it right back together and it seals perfectly fine. So I'm gonna go ahead and use it. So I wash it out first. And then I try it with, of course, my McDonald's sweet tea. And oh my gosh, I love them. I was looking for trash cans for my daughter's room and I came across this really cute one. I love the fact that it had this little hollow compartment in the bottom. So I went to the dollar store and I picked up this set of garbage bags. And so it says just to kind of feed the first one through. So there I'm trying to put it through there. And then it seemed like there was probably too many bags actually on that because it was a little tight to actually close the compartment, but it worked. And then I really liked the fact that it had this little ring on the top so that way it can keep the garbage bag in place. And then once the garbage can is full, it's so easy because you just take that little ring back off and then you can just pull that garbage bag out and the next one is right there for you. I got it for under $10. Here's a screenshot of a couple different companies that actually sell it. This is one of my very first Amazon finds and I am still in love with it. It is a tea infuser. So you're going to get your favorite loose leaf tea or it can just be simple Lipton tea in a bag or whatever you use. You're going to get hot water and just fill it up. This is actually the 28 ounce one and I usually fill it about halfway, but they also sell different sizes. Once you have it filled up with hot water, you can then add whatever sugar you want to it. I just put Truvia on top of mine and then you're just gonna let it seep. And while it's seeping, I go ahead and just fill my cup up with ice. And then it's literally as simple as just putting it right on top of your cup. And then it just comes right out the bottom, holding all of that tea behind. And then look at that, it makes the best cup of iced tea. If you don't wanna put it over ice, you could also just do it hot, but it is super easy to use and the cleanup is super easy as well. And here's a screenshot of the item from Amazon. 